Hello children, welcome to the video brought to you by Army Public School, Delhi Cant. And I am your host, Mrs. Sushmata Mehta from the Primary Wing English Department. Rohan and Priya with us. And let's see what they have to say. Rohan says, I hear. And Priya says, I have. And when they are saying these words, they both are really confused. Can you tell me why are they confused with Rohan's I hair and Rhea's I hair? They are confused because Rohan's I and Rhea's I sounds the same. Dono ki awaaz same aa rahi hai na dono words ki and Rohan's hair H E A R and Rhea's hair H E R E it also sounds the same but what is different Rohan's I what it means it means self one I main wala I and Rhea's I means I wala, body organ wala, I. And Rohan's hair, H-E-A-R hair means listening one hair, sunne wala hair. And Rhea's hair, H-E-R-E hair means place wala hair, yaha wala hair. So now you know why both of them are confused. They are saying the same thing. They are thinking that... We are speaking, we are saying the same thing. But still, we are unable to judge what we are saying. This is the reason why both of them are confused. Because what they are saying, it is different. Their sound is same. What they are saying, its sound is same. But what is different? Its meaning is different. Whatever they are saying, its meaning is different. So, dear children, today we are going to learn about this only. The words which have same sound but their meanings are different. Such kind of words are known as homophones. What are these words known as? Homophones. According to syllables, we can divide these words into two parts. Homo and phones. We can divide these wor this word into two parts. Homo and phones. Homo means same. The word homo means same. Homo ka matlab kya hota hai? Same. And phone means, you all know na, we all have phones with us. And what do we do in that phone? Yes, we talk and we listen. So what do we hear in that phone? Yes, you all are absolutely right. We hear sound in that. What do we hear in it? Sound. So, phone also means sound. So, homophone means same sound words. But, what is different in it? It's meaning and spelling. What is different in homophones? It's meaning and it's spelling. As we had seen it before, that I and E-Y-E-I, it's Sound was same, but what was different? The spellings were different and the meaning of both the words were different. So, such kind of words are known as homophones. Is it clear, children? So, we will try to understand the, this with some more, few more examples. You can see this picture. This is the picture of a sun. I'm sure you all know that it is a 
sun and its meaning is it is a star very good and this is the picture of a sun again but its spelling is s o n sun you can see na these both suns their sound is same but what is different its meaning is different isn't it and its spelling is different the first sun s u n sun means a star and the second sun s o n sun means a person in relation so you can see that these both words their sound is the same but what is different their spellings are different and their meanings are different we will further see the different by framing a sentence with both the words like sun the sun is shining brightly isn't it and sun my uncle's son is in class 4 so i hope now you are able to understand the difference between these two words we will take up one example let's see this picture oh it's an 8 what is it it is an 8 which 8 e i g h t 8 what it means Yes you are right it's a number and where do you use this number we basically use it it every day in our maths class very good and we have one more picture with us let's see what is it oh this little girl what it is she showing that she has ate her food yes eat a t e a t now what does this a t means that she has finished eating now again you can see that both these words they sound the same their sound is the same but what is different their spelling is different and their meaning is different first eight e i g h t means it's a number and second eight a t e a t means that you have finished eating is it clear now again we'll frame a sentence and we'll understand the difference between the two words i ate my dinner at 8 o'clock now you can clearly see the difference between these two words in this single sentence like i ate i ate matlab ate past tense of word eat kha liya matlab i have already eaten main already kha chuki hu my dinner at 8 o'clock 8 again you can see the sound is the same but the meaning is different isn't it so i hope you all have understood what are homophones so homophones are the words which have the words which have same sound but different meaning and different spellings i'll repeat it once again homophones are the words which have same sound like we saw it in the word eight eight e i g h t eight and a t e eight it had same sound but what was different kya alag tha usme dono words ka meaning the meaning of both the words were different and what was different their spellings were different so such kind of words are known as homophones and the trick to remember what are homophones is homo means same and phone means sound so children always remember it with the trick of phone phone sound phone means sound 
own meal sound. So you can always remember it like this. I hope you all have understood what are homophones. So have a nice day. Thank, thank you. Have a nice day. Take care. Stay inside. Stay safe. And have a nice day.